Today we're talking all about the Keep Going line of first aid products. Now this is more than just a first aid kit. This is an amazing company that has designed and created items for moms, dads, kids, babysitters, whoever, to use in everyday life for bumps, boo-boos, scrapes, burns, bug bites, you name it. Hey guys, welcome. If you are new here, my name is Lois, and here on my channel we talk about family products, baby gear, mom life, I do some vlogs, and I will test just about anything I can get my hands on. So if any of that sounds fun and interesting to you, please remember to hit the subscribe button. If you are a returning subscriber, welcome back and thank you for your support. Today's video is all about the Keep Going First Aid Kits. Now these are not just your average, everyday, run-of-the-mill first aid kits. No, no, no. They are the most beautiful, well-organized, and well-packed first aid kits that fit in your diaper bag, your stroller, your stroller wagon, your gym bag, your school bag, your glove box. Wherever you may possibly need a first aid kit, this will fit. Now they come in three sizes. There is the standard size, which is what I use for my diaper bag. There is the super kit, which we pack in our car. And then there is the mini kit. And this is perfect as a clip-on to my son's backpack for school or play dates. Now we will dig into all of these kits. I'll show you what's packed in them. Um, why I love them and then at the end of the video we'll take a look at all of the amazing and beautiful prints and colors available in these. So to recap, this is the standard size keep going first aid kit. This is what I carry in my diaper bag and my car in all bags. This I do not leave the house without this. This is a necessity. So when you get your Keep Going First Aid Kit in whatever beautiful and gorgeous print you choose, this is the size and not only does it come fully stocked with everything that you will need for bumps, scrapes, boo-boos, burns, bug bites, bruises, etc. But it is without a doubt the world's most organized first aid kit. I absolutely love it. Now I've had mine for several months and yes, we do use it every day. So on the first side of the first aid kit, there is this clear vinyl pocket and in it you will get a little sewing kit, some Q-tips, nail cutters. Um, there's also a little pair of scissors right there and there is a nail file down there as well. On the first page, you get some band-aids, some ointments, the second page you will get some antiseptic towelettes. Um, in the back of mine I put some gloves but there's some more ointments and aspirin, more band-aids and ibuprofen. And then on this page there are bigger band-aids and then some anti-itch cream and then these little goodies at the bottom, those are tick removers. Now in this mesh pocket, it does come standard with stickers and all sorts of goodies, but I have put in here some items that I grab for regularly. You can definitely fit a lot in this back mesh pocket. You don't have to, you can keep it as is, but I'm thankful that I can put more in here. You can also put some face masks in there as well. So this is the super kit. It is about twice the size as the standard kit and this print is the boho print. It is one of their new prints. And On the outside there is a little hanging loop so you can hang this from a door or a hook if you need to and then there is a grab handle as well. Opening this up on this front flap you'll see these two clear vinyl pockets. In this vinyl pocket you have a sewing kit a nail clipper, a nail file, some medical tape, and tick removers. And on this side, we have hand sanitizer, gloves, and a nosebleed plug. 
on the first page right here, we have all the gorgeous fabric band-aids, some antibiotic ointment, anti-itch cream, and first aid burn cream. Now, I do wanna say that all of the band-aids that you see here are latex-free, and not only are they gorgeous, but these also match the prints that you can get your first aid kits in. So turning to the next page, you'll see here we have more of the fun band-aids. Some lip balm, antibiotic ointment, and more burn cream. And then on this page, we have ibuprofen, non-aspirin, and aspirin. And then we have some larger size band-aids. And in the back, right over here, this is the antiseptic towelettes. And these on this page, you'll see that at the bottom, you have some safety pins, some Q-tips, and then these are the body temp strips. They are little adhesive strips that you stick onto your forehead, and then they light up indicating the actual temperature. The other items on the page include some gauze pads, there's an iPad, there's also a first aid mask, which I think is fantastic, and then oversized gauze pads, and then an abdominal pad um, for bleeding, so kind of like a compress pad. Um, on, the back, on this back page, you'll see that right here, there is a cold pack. In the middle, there are fun stickers, because stickers make all boo-boos better some first aid blankets, and then this is a triangle bandage, I think they call it. So this you can use to make an arm sling if you need to. And then last in here is the conforming band-aid bandage, um, right here. So there you go. It's a really complete and well thought out first aid kit. I am so impressed with this, and I love the print because Yes, it's a first aid kit, it has to be practical, but who says it couldn't be pretty, right? So moving on to the last first aid kit, this is the super cute new mini kit, and I got this in the emoji print, and it's so cute. It does come standard with a carabiner, so you can actually attach this to your kids' backpacks. And in here, there are band-aids and stickers. So if your kiddo is at school or play date or with a friend and they get hurt, they have the stickers and a huge assortment of band-aids to make life a little better. And so not only can this go on my son's backpack for school and it's a great little handy first aid kit, but I can also put his mask in here or if he needs access to his inhaler for seasonal allergies, I can put it in here super handy and so amazing. Next up are the adorable and super cute little toasties. I got an elephant and a sloth. And they are so fun. Okay, so these adorable little animals are filled with clay beads that are scented with lavender essential oils and they are super soft on the outside and they have some comforting weight to them. They're not super heavy at all, but they have enough weight to them that if you use these as a weighted lap pad for your little one, it will help calm them. Um, you can either stick these in the microwave to warm up the beads, or you can stick them in a Ziploc bag and place them in the freezer to use them as a cool pad. I'll give you a close up of these so you guys can see the detail in these because they are super cute. So this is the sloth with his cute little face and then his little feet. Super cute. And then the elephant, which is my favorite. Next up is the little chilies. Now, like the little toasties, these can be used hot or cold. These are filled with gel beads. They kind of remind me of Orbeez in sensory play bins. And they are super cute. There are a couple of different character prints that you can choose from. 
we picked this set which comes with a llama, a mermaid, and a unicorn. Now, you can stick these in the freezer and then throw them in your lunchbox if you want. You can also use these if you have a boo-boo. You can just use them as a cold compress for a boo-boo. These are really good for bruises or just owies in general. Um, we absolutely love these. I will say my daughter, who is one, loves the sloth and then my son, who is five, actually love these. So I think it just depends on your kids and what they prefer, but all of these items are so amazing. So now that you guys have seen all the amazing products that they now carry on their website, I wanted to show you guys some of the prints that are available in their first aid kits because these are super cute and they actually match with a lot of diaper bag brands. All right, you guys, and that is it for this video. If you have any comments or questions, please feel free to drop them in the comment section below. I hope you guys enjoyed my video. Have a fantastic day.